Before I go, there's something. Take your seat. There's something I want to say concerning 2019 election now. When I was given the last final prophecy between Atiku and Buhari, I said something. For those who watched our prophecies concerning Nigeria in 2016 and 2017, when the media uploaded the prophecy I gave in Atiku, I said, I saw where Atiku walked to the throne as he wanted to sat to the, uh, in the throne, design green, white, green. Somebody came out and removed the throne and he sat on the ground. During last year, December, when I was concluding the prophecy, and I said that when that throne reappeared, the sitting president, Bugari, was already sitting on it. Now I want to tell you something. And I said I'm going to make a major comment about it. And why I said I'm going to make a major comment is a lot of people I watch in our channel, Action God TV, some of them that go on online to comment don't even understand who God is. Let me tell you, there's a time God will look and because of somebody, God can change his mind. If you don't know God changing his mind, I'm telling you now. When God said, Hezekiah, you will die, did God change his mind? There are so many places in the Bible God has changed his mind. When I got the prophecy about America in 2010, that I saw where Obama handed over to a woman, then three months to the election, I was ministering in New York. I said, I saw where Trump took over the throne. The reason why God changed his mind, we didn't know. And I told you people that as of December of last year, I see Bugatti coming out as the next president. But the surprising thing is this. That even till now, election is remaining six days. That prophecy have not changed. The man I saw that walked to the throne is not the man I see that will sit on it. I know there is no other Sunday service till after the election and that's why I decided to talk about it now. Because even if there is anything the Lord will minister to me that will happen within two, three days to the election, I don't think I might have time to sit with the media to discuss it. I might take up our handle in, in Facebook or Twitter and post it. But as of now, as I'm talking, what I see is still what I see. You know, what makes a prophet a genuine one is the confidence of you maintaining what you have said. Amen? And that is what I wanted to say because I promise on the last prophecy, which will have over hundred and something thousand people on followers in the last prophecy, the one of particular will have over two, getting to 300,000 followers. I promise that I'm going to make a major statement before the election day. And we have six days to the election day. But if there is anything rather than that, I will still come or I will send it uh, with our handle. But for now, what I've seen is still what is still operating in the spiritual realm. Thus says the Lord. God bless you, church.